How's it going everyone and welcome to an indie horror game called Siren Head. I don't know much about this creature. Apparently it was a creature that was Canadian. That was Canadian. It's a creature created by Trevor Henderson. I, I don't know if it's like a creepypasta, but he's, he's a Canadian person. I don't know much about Siren Head, um, but let's find out. Let's play this game. So what I'm going to be doing on this channel is I didn't upload for a while because, you know, I became a father and so I was very busy. What I will be doing this week is I'm going to be uploading one indie horror game one shot every day for a whole week. So the first one we're going to be doing is Siren Head. And all throughout the week I'm going to be doing others. Indie horror one shots that take like one hour or less once a day for seven days. I think it's going to be pretty cool. Before I begin, I thought of a really funny joke, okay? Do you want to hear it? Okay, look at this. It took me a really long time to think this up. Uh, I got a siren. I got a head. Uh, Siren Head. Alright, let's just begin. Siren Head. Oh, those were- that was like some, uh... That was some 8-bit goodness, that noise. Sounded like an old-school Nintendo. Kind of menu sound. Pine Ridge Hiking Trail, no vehicles allowed. Okay, so we're supposed to go that way, right? Yeah, we're supposed to go that way. So we parked right here. For some reason, I thought we were supposed to go this way. I was like, <laughs> did, did we park the truck on the other side of the gate? How did we do that? Alright. Oh. Oh, yeah, the birds are out. What is a siren doing in the woods? This doesn't make it- that is super loud. Oh my god. What is this? So clearly something happened here. Someone crashed. I'm not too sure what that is. But someone crashed. And that's, uh, I don't know. It's some glass of sort why, why don't I know what that is? I feel like I should understand what this object is in front of me. Maybe it's just like part of a bumper. There's like scratch marks there. Like, did S Siren Head clearly scratch there? Okay, and there's other scratch marks up here. It's becoming night. Oh god, I mean, why are we out here? Yeah, there's more scratch marks. So Siren Head is... Clearly a monster with a siren... <laughs> ...on its head? But... Why? Like, w w there's gotta be a story behind it, though. Was it a person... ...that died in a horrible way and they heard sirens that were... ...that was going off? Uh, because police tried to come and they did something. Maybe the police killed him and they heard police sirens as they died and they're like, I'm coming back for revenge! Bah! Oh. That's... a torn cloth or something. I mean, that's that's a lot of blood. That's clearly a body that was ripped apart. I love the pine on the tree smell. Mmm. Ah, delicious. I miss the outdoors. I've been inside for quite a long time. I'm actually a little jealous of Siren Head. Oh, I see. When you right-click, you can zoom in. Oh my god, that's so... Okay, cool. I guess I should have looked at the controls. It's a backpack. Maybe it belongs to the missing hiker. But why leave it behind? Okay, so we were supposed to be following a story the whole time. God, guys, guess what? I'm dumb. A scrap of shirt. Looks like there was a struggle. <laughs> that's... I should have been doing it the whole time. Wow, I'm that much of a failure. More strange scratch marks. So now we get the story. <laughs> the scratches seem to lead up here. Yeah, so why don't we just follow the big scratches after we heard that siren noise? I mean, why not, right? I mean, we've already seen the blood. We know what's up here. Let's... Let's go. I have to get back to the truck now! Oh, I see. Okay. Oh my god, it's Siren Head! Those are the sirens I heard. He is huge, man. That's creepy looking. He's got mouth. That's, that's a mouth on the sirens. That's really creepy looking. No. No. Oh, you can't get me. You can't get me. Should I even turn around? No, just run. Just run. Okay, I think we're far away. Okay, Siren Head, I'm, I'm just gonna put it out there. Siren Head is really creepy and really off-putting. 
that's probably like the sound of the hiker dying, the hiker like running away. Like Siren Head like records things and then just like blurts it out of the uh, the megaphone on top or whatever, the speaker on his head. Man, that's, that's pretty twisted, man. Ah, uh, that's, that's really twisted. Let's get out. Okay. We're driving away, we escaped Siren Head. Wait, what, what? Wait, I was driving away, what happened? Did I not run back to the truck fast enough to, what? What happened? Is Did you just die anyways? Okay, let's try like sprinting back to the truck after. Let's see what let's see what happens. Okay, I sprinted back so fast. Do I can I still get out? Is it just gonna be the same ending? I literally just beelined it for the truck this time. Like if Siren Head catches up to me, that doesn't make sense. I'm so far away. And he moves so slow. Unless he just starts sprinting. That's it. That's the whole game. It's weird how these things blow up on YouTube. You know, like, I went into this game, I was like, Ooh, Siren Head, this is like the new hot stuff in, 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 the, in the indie horror stratosphere. I just, I expected a little bit more. Okay, it was like kind of neat, like leading up the trail to the hiker, seeing him die. And then when Siren Head comes out, like the big reveal, that's what he looks like. Like, Siren Head is huge and, uh, you know, pretty terrifying. But then you just run away from him and it's the end. Okay, well, today's video is very short. I mean, it's the first one of seven, and so there's going to be a lot of indie horror videos this week. So do not fret. Tomorrow we will do another one, and I promise that one will be a little bit longer. You know, Siren Head was creepy looking. I like it how, like, he talked through things. It seemed like things that he had recorded or whatever from other people, and, and he, like, talks and communicates that way. That's, like, kind of cool. I just wish there was a little more to it. Like, I wish it was just a little longer because when he first pops up, you go, oh shit, I gotta get out of here. And then you get out and it's done. Like, they could have made the journey into the forest a little deeper. And so when you're running out, it's a, just a little bit longer of a sequence because that was really short. Like I'm talking, there just wasn't enough time to build the suspense and it just kind of fell flat a little bit. It was okay. Like I said, it was really neat seeing Siren Head, but they could have done Siren Head a little more justice, you know what I mean? They could have done him just a little bit more justice. But what do I know? I'm not a game designer, but I, I expected a little bit more. I mean, I only paid a dollar for this. You can pay however much you want. <laughs> just, was it worth the dollar? I baby. I will see you guys in the video tomorrow. As always, peace.